Computer science is logical and mysterious at the same time. Transfer your human language into a language that the computer understands. Gives you is the power to provide human beings with the solution. Studies the underlying nature of computations. Arguably, over the past 20 years, no other field has changed the way we live than computer science, machine learning, databases, computer networking, computer music, visualization, software engineering, distributed systems, advanced topics in machine learning, and artificial intelligence, embedded systems. NYU Shanghai, we currently have about 40 computer science majors every year. Our very renowned faculty in their research areas, and they're all outstanding instructors. My favorite course is machine learning because it's so cool. Deep learning methods makes you think in a very data-driven way. It can help us to solve so many non-convex problems. This lab is used by computer science and engineering students. We have a course called Digital Logic come here and they have hands-on experience on devices to check digital chips such as a CPU, compute the sum of two numbers or the multiplication of two numbers. So they have hands-on experience here with the material. Here the lighting controlled automatically by a controller that was designed by a student. The light turns on automatically if it detects people in the room. The light dims out, dims down a little if there is a lot of sunlight from outside, and that finally we save a lot of energy. Music can be interpreted from an information perspective. So we develop a, an algorithm that can automatically learn the difference between different acoustic properties and transfer the performance. I use haptic device or magic gloves that you can just put those gloves on your finger, on your hands, and it moves. So you learn the music by feeling about it. After taking this course, I learned that there's like this whole division of machine learning and computer science in general that's devoted to uh, learning about computer music and how we can kind of link psychology and computers and kind of study this sort of thing. At NYU Shanghai, we're very lucky to have our own high-performance computing environment. Both our faculty members as well as our students are allowed to work on that, to do their projects there. If they have any research or resource-intensive competitions, they can use it. So many data everywhere in our life, and computer science can help us to analyze them and to get a better understanding about what's going on. Data structures. In this course, I can learn how to improve the efficiency of my code, which is very important in programming. Distributed system. It is about how to asynchronize computing devices, computers work together to solve heavy and tedious problems. Computer science and math they have uh, deep connections. Algorithms tells you how to solve problems efficiently. Computer networking at NYU Shanghai, really fascinating because it really provides the foundation for how the internet works and how every kind of communication in the computer world happens. Operating systems seemed very daunting to me and I didn't know that much about it. But together here uh, with different students and the faculty here, I was able to learn a lot more in depth about operating systems. Something I want to explain them, to teach them is uh, how rigorous uh, computer science is. Teaching here is a, is a magnificent experience, but also uh, observing, interacting with uh, students. Not all computer scientists are nerds. In our students, they communicate with each other quite often. Our students are passionate, they are creative and works hard. They come from different cultural backgrounds. It's always fascinating to see how those uh, cultural differences collide sparkles wisdom. Not only teaches you how to think, it teaches you how to solve the problem in a very scalable, flexible, efficient way. In our courses, most of the courses are project-based learning. We have active learning scheme to provide project-based learning classes where the students actually get to work together, interview potential users, design and develop the system, and eventually deliver and maintain a working product by the end of the semester. Students get to spend a year abroad in New York or Abu Dhabi, which also provides a very rich set of elective courses that students can potentially take. NYU Shanghai, NYU New York is all together. I think that's what's great about this place is because you're getting so many different experiences by being in one place. I'm very proud that many of our students have gone on to top PhD programs in the world.
kind of a logical thinker, you'll most likely be good at computer science. But if you're both a logical thinker and a creative thinker, then you'll be outstanding at computer science.